it's Leanne here. I'm currently at the newly relocated Vancouver Christmas Market with um, Dee's family. <laughs> and she got free media passes so we can check it out. Previous years, the market was at Queen Elizabeth, but then they decided to expand and now they're at Waterfront Station at Jack Pool Plaza. And it's supposed to be a lot bigger and so I'm really excited to check it out to see if there's any new stuff. Between the stalls there's a lot more um, space so you guys can walk around and you're not bumping into people and because it's bigger there's definitely more stalls than before more food to try out and yeah there's also more displays and waterfronts a pretty um, nice location to begin with so with the actual market it makes it even nicer Hi everyone! Vancouver is definitely getting into the holiday spirit as a lot of events are starting to pop up around town. My first festive event for December is the Vancouver Christmas Market. Great for friends, family, or couples, MeCM is a fun way to spend an afternoon or evening sampling German treats and buying German or local crafts. Here are a few tips and tricks if you plan on going. Number 1. Go early. If you did not purchase tickets for the express lane, sometimes the lineup to get in can take anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour, so be sure to show up a little earlier to account for wait time. Number 2. Hit up the food stalls first. Stalls like pretzels and mulled wine are particularly popular, so if you're looking to eat, you might want to purchase those first before walking around. Number 3. Look for discounts. Usually on Groupon or Social Shopper, you will see coupons for SVCM, but the actual site also contains different packages for couples and families. Make sure you get the best deal you want before buying tickets. And number 4. Layer up. Being near waterfront this year, it can get really chilly, particularly at night, so be sure to bundle up extra tight to not get a cold. Overall, if you're a tourist in Vancouver and looking for a winter activity, I would definitely recommend VCM. And if you've been to it when it was still at Queen Elizabeth, I do find the change of location refreshing and worth a revisit. So that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, subscribe and join me on my next adventure. See you next video. Bye!